Well, our state government launched a video series to highlight those who've died from COVID-19 and those working on the front lines. Here are some of their stories. At 93 years old, Carolyn Sandberg's mother was healthy and cheerful. She was an amazing seamstress and her apartment was filled with projects and top of the line sewing equipment. Carolyn's mother was the sixth person in New Mexico to we die from COVID-19. But it'll be a long time before I recover from the death of my mother and the heartache of not being at her side when she took her last breath. Carolyn's mother's story is just one of several being featured in the state's From the Front Line series to put faces to the numbers of those lost, names to the workers on the front lines, and to remind people to continue social distancing. I'm a critical care nurse at San Juan Regional Medical Center in Farmington. Kristen McGrath is working in the emergency department and the intensive care unit. The fear in their eyes is unlike fear I've ever seen in my patient's eyes. It's the fear of dying. She's seeing very unexpected things happening to her patients. Like their blood is clotting in weird ways. I drew blood from one patient, and by the time I went to put it in a blood tube, it was already clotted. For Carolyn and Kristen, it's a message they hope New Mexicans will hear loud and clear. This disease is terrible, and you don't want it. Trust me. You don't want to be here again. This is all in an effort to remind people to stay home during this time. If you'd like to include your own personal story in this series, you could visit our website for more information on how to do that. Reporting in Albuquerque, Marissa Armas, KOAT Action 7 News.